see that the pump, you see that the two costs, and uh, my second fact is the roll-off. The roll-off is $47.5 trillion, uh, $9 trillion. Hi. My name is Wayne Pinson, and I'm the Director of Research and an Analyst covering the specialty chemical space alongside Rosemary Be Morbelli at Gabelli Funds. In March, Rosemary and I hosted our 14th annual Gabelli Specialty Chemicals Symposium at the Harvard Club in New York City. A total of 12 companies participated in the event, including Albemarle, American Vanguard, Atlas Lithium, BASF, Chase Corp, Ecolab, Element Solutions, Livent Corporation, Minerals Technologies, Piedmont Lithium, Quaker Howden, and Rainier Advanced Materials. The symposium focused on themes surrounding improving global supply chains, easing of raw material cost inflation and availability, interest rate impacts, and softening global demand. On Friday, the Wall Street Journal reported speculation that one of our presenting companies, Chase Corp, is exploring a potential sale of its business and has attracted multiple bidders, including private equity and strategic entities. We think the company's high margin, niche technologies with low capital requirements could be attractive to PE firms with an ex existing specialty chemical platform or a large global enti entity looking to gain more exposure in the U.S. market. Chase Corp has 8.5 million shares outstanding trading around 127 for a $1.2 billion market cap. They have around a net debt of around $110 million for a $1.3 billion enterprise value. While the company does little investor outreach and is underfollowed by the market, Chase has been a regular attendee at our symposium. Additionally, last month another conference particip participant, lithium producer Livent Corporation, announced a merger of equals with Australia-based Alchem to be completed by year-end. Over the years, our conference has featured numerous companies involved in financial engineering and has provided great insight not only into the companies themselves, but also their customers and end markets, which touch every aspect of the global economy. We hope you can join us next year at our 15th Annual Symposium. Thank you.